Hey guys, welcome to the Not of the Week. Today we're going to be going over the Munter Mule. We went over the Munter last week, which was a friction device used to control descents. And this week I want to show you how to lock that off if you needed to go hands-free while you're belaying or to escape a system. Okay guys, before we tie the munter mule, first I wanted to show a different way of starting the munter on a line that you might already have through a carabiner. What you can do is take a line like this, you can flip an overhand knot up like that. So basically if you have your hand here, then you're going to take that loop and just clip up into the carabiner, creating the munter. So the right side here simulates your break hand, so this is where I would be breaking with if I were belaying. And the first step in locking this off with a muncher mule is to flip up like so. So now, if I were to stretch this out here, you can really kind of see this a little bit better illustrator wise. So this is the starting point. You're going to flip up like this. And then I like to come through and grab and pull like this to, to bring that bite through. But one more time here to show you. What you're doing is really you could pull the bite too just like so, and put it into this, and then pull to tighten, like so. The idea and the premise behind this part here, this is kind of a quick release, and I'll show you why it is in a second, why it is a quick release. But as this reaches the top here, this is how it locks that off. So now, now it's really locked off, it's not gonna go anywhere. Um, what you can do now is you can pull this loop a little bit, just like so, and come around and back this up with just an overhand knot, like so. And you can take that overhand and make sure that it's as close as possible to the knot. So that's a properly backed up muncher mule. And then to come back onto belay, you would undo this, come back over, switch back to this hand, Pull it around this way and then pop back to belay this way. And you want to make sure you give your climber a heads up when you go to pop that back uh, from the munter mule to the munter. Stay tuned for a new Knot of the Week every Tuesday, and if you're enjoying what we're doing here on our Knot of the Week series, please consider joining the Crew Leader membership linked below in the description. Thanks for watching.